Hey everybody, it's Jason, and in today's video, we're gonna be covering taking care of your Dovo straight razor and the basics of how to use it so you can present this to your customers. Of course, I have a fantastic guest here all the way from Solingen, Germany, from the Dovo company, Jens Zeidvogel, who's gonna give us a little bit of an introduction in how to take care of this. So Jens, we've had videos now explaining how to select a Dovo straight razor and the basics with your top sellers. Um, Let's say I'm a customer and, you know, I get home. How, what should I tell them uh, in terms of their first experience with the Dovo straight razor and what they need to do with it? Yeah. So actually getting home, prepare yourself and start shaving. The razor comes ready to shave out of the box. So after you finish your shave, you need to clean and dry the razor blade so that the carbon steel cannot start rusting. So these should not be left wet. Very important that they are completely dried out. And if you're right. not gonna be using them for an extended period of time, you know, you might even apply like a paraffin oil or something to prevent yep. them from rusting. Exactly. Okay, great. So now, you know, you've put it away, you've dried it completely, it's, it's ready to go. It's a few days later now and you've given it a few different shaves. Do you wanna tell us about how you would actually strop the razor? Yeah, so stropping. We use normally a strop like this, a leather strop, and one thing is you keep it absolutely tight and straight. May I borrow dry. your index, please? Yeah, and this is an older one, like this is that's your personal one, strop. That's my personal one, uh, carry, accompanying me for many, many years. Okay, so this is what it looks like. Years. This is what it looks like after many, many years. Right. A brand new strop, for example, would look something like this, so you have sort of these. And a strop is just very simply kind of a leather material, right? It is leather, so we have naturally tanned leather here. So Got it. the best quality you can get for the strop. Okay. And finally, in order to keep this strop soft, you need the leather balm to put on the surface and keep Got your it. strop in a good mood. So this is a this is a conditioning paste for the strop leather right. to be able to kind of take care exactly. of it. So basically one strop will last you a whole lifetime pretty much. It can. So that's about 25 years and okay. my second one. Okay. So it actually is my best friend, okay. or my razor's best friend. Perfect. So, so basically, if you have a hook somewhere, you hook the strop on there. I'm going to pretend to be your hook here. Exactly. So please be my hook for the time being. What are we doing? We keep the strop very tight. Please keep okay. it tight. Yeah. So not over tight. We don't have to pull an elephant out of the basket. So put first the spine the razor spine on and the cutting edge mm -hmm. so that always spine and edge are in touch with the strop. Got it. Then pull towards the spine, turn over the spine and then pull back. Always direction spine. Got it. Until you get into a very flowing movement like this. Okay. So you can also do it diagonally to, put, to meet all spots of the razor's edge it must glide on the surface and then it's fine. Perfect, okay, great. So really the concept is you use the strop to just prepare the razor for another fresh shave. Exactly. Okay, so for the next section, we're gonna talk a little bit about how you actually would shave with these straight razors. What we wanna cover is if you're a retailer and you're selling these products in your shop, you wanna give your customer just a quick introduction to the most important points. And those three points really that we're gonna cover now are skin preparation, so getting your skin ready for the shave, um, how you actually hold the straight razor in your hand when you're shaving, and then finally, the you know basic technique of how to do this. Okay, so the first piece that we wanna cover is skin Skin prep and this is true for all wet shaving it's critical to having a great quality shave to get the skin nice and ready for when you're shaving now that means that you obviously want to shave wet with a straight razor though especially it's all about glide you want to make sure that you're using a shave soap and a skin prep regime that's going to give you really great glide so that the blade glides over your skin um, very popular are to use glycerin based shave soaps so a soft shave soap uh, often a basic glycerin soap can give you a lot of great glide and often you'll see people using an apothecary style shave mug it's not even not uncommon to have people kind of melt these things and this are microwave safe to be able to do that um, and then basically using a brush to whip up a great lather to apply to their face okay so step two is how you hold the actual straight razor in your hand and I want Jens to kind of give us a quick demonstration with his straight razor so generally keep the razor tight but don't get nervous about it okay. so I do it this way Simply open and finally I would like to see a 90 degree angle of handle and blade. Perfect. So this gives me a good 
hold of the blade later on to operate and control it. Okay, so the last uh, sort of technique question is really how you actually, you know, shave your face. Now, we're not going to actually, Jens is not going to actually shave his face here. Uh, it's really more for you to sort of do an in-store demonstration, but give us kind of the basic techniques and things you want to think about when you're actually using the straight razor to shave. Okay, holding the razor as described previously, I put it here holding the skin, skin tight. So, it's, so it's very important to make the skin nice and taut. And that is, then, you want... Yeah. And then follow in small strokes down, always keeping touch of edge and skin. Got don't, it. Don't start rollating this, but keep on the skin and get down. So you want to be gliding on the skin. You want to be kind of just at the edge of the you know, right on top of the skin, not on and off, you don't, it's like a right. record, you know what I mean? You don't want to be on and off, you want to be on the record the whole yeah. time, and, but nice, smooth, sh short strokes. Always in touch with the skin. Got it. Keep in touch. Okay, so perfect. I can hold it this way, and also, I can also then go for the other direction, this way. So, the standard holding is this, either for this side, or I go for this side to shave down at the throat. Okay, great. So, remember, these are the basics. Obviously, the straight razor is an aficionado product, okay? It is for somebody who really wants to go and have that full experience. You can get a lot of the same sort of benefits of a straight razor also with a double-edged safety razor, and we have lots of videos about double-edged safety razors. Yep. So these are fantastic products, but they are products for that customer who really wants the full straight razor shaving experience. Thanks for watching. If you're interested in carrying any of these products in your retail shop, Please contact us at permabrands.com or if you're a barber or barbershop at barbersupplies.com.